YouTube, it's Tiki's Trinkets here and today I have for you a new polymer clay update. I know this is a very small update, well most of mine have been recently but I haven't had a lot of time to work on things. But I do have polymer clay and resin pieces in this update so hopefully that will make it a little more interesting than it has been. First I'm going to start with the resin pieces, I'm going to start like I do usually from my least favorite to my most favorite. Well with this one I'm going to start with actually an older piece. This is an older piece that I made, but I don't think I ever showed it on a video, nor have I put it anywhere except maybe DeviantArt. But I don't know if I showed it there either. And as you can see, it's just like a typical resin kit, and I use silver glitter on the back, bead bells to glue on to attach them to charms to make them into keychains. This one, I think I'm going to give away as a Christmas present. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it. This one, I'm going to be putting up on my Etsy shop. The other one's a present a uh, present to a friend. Get to focus. Doesn't want to focus on it. Well, if it will ever focus, it is a snowflake heart. There we go. That's a little better. There we go. It's a snowflake heart. It's got blue glitter on the back side. Again, attached with a bead bell. And it's got three little diamonds on the inside. They're acrylic diamonds, and I don't really like how these turned out in here, so I won't do that again. The Christmas tree one also had diamonds in it. If you can see. Yeah. But they just kind of look dark and foggy, so I'm probably not going to add diamonds again. And lastly, the one for my friend. Again, has a diamond in it, but you can kind of see this one better. It's a pink diamond, and she wanted an elephant charm. So I had like a little bracelet that I just cut the pendant off. And this I put with purple glitter on it. Again, another bead bell attached with glue. And I'll be making probably all these into keychains. Next, here are my polymer clay charms that I've made. This is my Harley Quinn-inspired bunny from the new Suicide Squad version of Harley Quinn. Just like in the movie, she sticks her tongue out a lot, so I decided to stick his tongue out. And if you could see, there we go. His eyes, well, her eyes, are brushed with mica powder, just like Harley Quinn's um, makeup in the movie. Also, her pigtails are the bunny's ears. Again, brushed with mica powder. They're pink and blue. This piece actually came out really nice. Here's the back side. And I will be doing more fan art bunnies like this. Maybe a Deadpool bunny, I don't know. And last but not least, I made a new lion. This is from my Neon Lion collection. And again, it has diamond eyes. If you remember, if you don't remember the old one, I'll show it right here. This is the first one I made. It was in a... I think it was in my 13th update or my 12th update. I don't remember. It was an older one. But I'm doing neon colors. Well, kind of neon -y. And this one I have laying down. He is adorable. This is my most favorite from this update. And the blue clay right here is kind of sparkly. Here's his butt. Lion butt. Doot, doot, lion butt. Doot. Okay. And he's just kind of leaning on his arm. Here's the back side. Usually the bottom of my figures don't look this clean, but even the bottom on this looks really clean. And yeah, that's it for this update. Let me move the old one out of the view. I hope you all like this video. Stay tuned for more tutorials and videos by me. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Bye-bye, YouTube.